Hi, my name is Joy Clarion, and I'm doing a follow-up video to Eve, why she should bite the apple. Um, I got a lot of flack for that video. I'm glad that people were interested. And so, you know, there are many, many opinions about that video. Um, just to say, if you think about it, um, it was her choice. It's like, you say you're telling her that she has to love God no matter what, and she can't make a choice whether she wants to love her father. So it's a personal choice. And she was in, she was trapped in that garden with her husband for who knows how long. She was very educated. God had educated them both in, in, in knowledge. So she knew it was wrong, but she wanted a change for her life. Is that so wrong that people, you know, want to have a change for themselves? And you're telling her that she can't do it. You're like so invested in her life. You're saying that she can't choose to to have a disagreement with her father and see where that that lands her. And apparently, it landed her in a good good relationship with her father because her father could have killed her, but he chose not to. He chose mercy. So right there, she finds out her father is loving, kind, and merciful, and that he wasn't going to kill her for eating the apple like his prized apples um because they say you know in the bible that you should not die the snake told her that that your eyes will be opened and he wasn't lying because this moment she ate the apple what had took place in the garden in in, in genesis is that she's still living on she didn't die until like she was like 900 of age um and so you know, her father didn't kill her. And it's kind of like, it's a test of faith. You know, is my parent going to kill me over these apples, these delicious apples that he grew? I mean, who knows? You got to check to see if your, your parent is, is a loving parent. And I think that's what she did. She tested the limit. She was naked in the garden. She wanted to change for her life.